the two honorable members, uh, Mr. Gujaral has discussed with me also, and with the honorable minister, Mr. Derek O'Brien has raised this issue, that there is a dichotomy in this bill, yes. that for selling a child, the punishment would be five years, and for uh, giving drugs to a child, the punishment would be seven years. So on the principle of proportionality, that uh, selling is a harsher crime and therefore should have been higher than giving drugs. That's the argument which has been raised. Prima facie, there is weight in the argument. I'll just uh, uh, clarify that uh, there is a little bit of a uh, going in circles in order to understand this. If uh, the honorable members may just read section uh, clause 88 of this act. Now, both selling a minor or a major, selling a trafficking in a human being, as also giving drugs, trafficking is already the, an offense. These are offenses under the Penal Code. These are also offenses under the Narcotics Act. So these are already existing offenses. So even if this act was not there, these would be existing offenses. Now, Clause 88 says, where an act or omission constitutes an offense punishable under this act and also under any other law for the time being in force, then notwithstanding anything contained in any such law, the offender found guilty of such offense shall be liable for punishment under such law which provides for punishment which is greater in degree. So clause 88 says, if the same offense is an offense under two different acts, then the greater of the two punishments shall apply to him. And therefore, Mr. Derek O'Brien and Mr. Naresh Gujaral's concern that uh, the punishment for trafficking in a minor is lesser than drugs, section 370 of the Indian Penal Code says, Whoever for the purpose of exploitation recruits, transports, harbors, transfers, or receives a person or persons by using threats, etc., etc., and then in subclause, subsection 2, whoever commits an offense of trafficking shall be punished with rigorous imprisonment of a term which shall not be less than seven years, but which may extend to 10 years. And subclause 3 says, if you indulge in uh, uh, trafficking of more than one person, then it will be life imprisonment. So under clause 88, the harsher of the two punishments will apply. And under section 370 of the Indian Penal Code, the minimum punishment is already seven years. So actually, even though this bill has mentioned that punishment, in terms of uh, interpretation of the section, it's the punishment under section 370 which will apply. So there is no uh, inconsistency as it uh, on a first reading appears to be. Thank you. Sir. Thank you.